Hello and welcome to the exciting new series all about me playing Black Ice. I don't know how long it will run. Uh, I'm the plucky hero and I'm sure you're going to see some bit of gameplay. I'm going to play this as if I'm playing hardcore. Um, some games where you just play and it doesn't matter if you die or there's very little downside. Just, uh, just don't dig that. Here you can see all my failed attempts. Um, I tried recording this before, but I had some issues with like saves with white, hard drive failure. So I'm just going to start fresh. Uh, let's randomise the height handle so we get some. Uh, wow, zero crew. <coughs> and, uh, Phoenix. Don't think I've played as Phoenix. Let's uh, do that. I quite like the randomised height handle. Some interesting sort of hacker cyber space, space names. Uh, for all of you that don't know about Black Ice, it's kind of a funky. So the cyberspace, um, I'm trying to think of what first person shooter elements with RPG elements with looting, all about the loot, a bit of leveling up and it's got like a central goal of like hacking the main big building which is apparently pretty hard. I haven't got very far in the game because uh, I keep on dying. Uh, let's see how this run does. Right, checking in. Boom, here we go. Very colourful. I do like the graphics. Okay, that, that sound worries me. Is it the shark? There's like, in the centre of the island, defending that big white building over there, is like, a shark. Which, uh, basically think of blimp with like, missile launchers. Very dangerous. Uh, so I'm quite scared of that. The music, I quite like it. It's got a fun, funky sort of music. Uh, the whole feel of this is just so sort of, uh, I guess is it like the 80s or 90s sort of uh, vision of cyberspace, which is good. Um, so let's get jump straight in. Uh, got a little very small uh, weapon there. Um, and to hack buildings, to get the loot inside, you just right click on, well, you use a uh, icebreaker. Oh geez. Hello. And then these little mobs, oh no, that's not good. Oh, they swarm me, you have to like shoot them and then grab the health. It's quite... And these little fellows, oh, it's quite intense, you can see. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah. Right. Yeah, so that's not how to do it at all, or explain what's happening. Um, so if we look back at all that before I started panicking, uh, like, uh, if you don't like spiders, don't play this game, folks. Because um, those things look like spiders and pretty creepy. So basically, what happened was, I used, let's pop the inventory and see what it's called. I used an icebreaker, um, which is in my hot bar here, right clicked, and it created like a little arena. You may have noticed those, uh, sort of circular outline around the building and that can vary depending on the stats of your skills and the item in question and if you leave that it stops your hack and all the monsters disappear which is very handy if you're on low health or a bit cautious you can sort of hang around the edge and shoot the monsters and pick them off what you don't want to do is what i did stand around and going uh what do i do what do i do now what what's happening oh no screen shake and like panic and as you can see we've got a nice little reward i think um blue things is fairly good, it's not the rarest, but it's just a nice, it's a new icebreaker, how appropriate. So let's just compare the stats of this. <coughs> I'm also trying how, remembering how to play this game, so I've played it for a little bit of a while. So hacking speed, it's a bit faster, it uses a lot more RAM, which I guess is our energy pool, which makes sense, being the computer, side space speed. Um, its range is a lot better and it gives us RAM in return so it sort of replenishes our RAM which is always good. I'm going to stick it in the right mouse slot now and also can level up so that's T. Now we've got hack speed increase, weapon damage, attack speed, range, different sniping, crit chance, crit damage, accuracy, even speed, even more. But I <coughs> love that. I love the loop, and I try and level up this as much as possible. Um, make sure I've got the right bar. Choices are permanent, by the way, folks, so they make sense. Uh, because uh, I think getting good loot drops early on, and then having that sort of uh, good fortune continue, 
now because it does seem a lot of your, uh, you have to excuse me, I'm also a bit ill at the moment, a lot of your um, abilities and stats are very dependent on the items you have. So the better the items, the better the stats, the better you do. That's my theory anyway. Uh, let's hack this uh, Smash Riot Corporation. Okay, so you see that yellow bar we've got to keep in that arena. See those where those little bright particle effects are? That's where the uh, enemies are spawning. That lets me know they're spawning. It's very handy. There's also a bar telling me how many enemies are left once we've completed the hack. You can notice there's that road is going there. It's white when it's tapping, but when it's golden, it means no more enemies can spawn. Do not shoot me with your little lady. So yeah, that sort of gives you a like visual, which I really like about this game. It's got a lot of visual cues, a lot of information you can pick up by just looking around. Like you can tell that this is not a brilliant loot drop, it's a common loot drop. It picks up a cyber missile. Can I just get a weapon upgrade? It tells me like DPS, it's higher DPS, it's cooldown, way higher, twice as and it's range. Not got good range. Of course it's explosions. Um, how much RAM does it use? 14. And this uses 1. I'm like a prey and spray kind of guy. Uh, we'll put it in there, because it's always good to have weapons equipped, but I probably won't be using that for a lot. Oh, we can level up again. Boo. Yeah, so... <sighs> As you can see, my jump is pathetic, but uh, if you look into the distance, this is a jumping puzzle game. Sort of a building, where there's like a really nice loot at the top, it's level 50, so we won't hack it just yet. Should we see if I can jump up here? It's a good way to get loot very early on. We need like a jetpack or something. I need to learn how to jump with loot. It's painful, painful. Um, if you can tell, I didn't really have a console when I was growing up, so... I like platforming skills, very subpar. Now, uh, strategy games, that's my forte. I say forte, probably the game I'm best at. But I'm getting better, I'm getting better at uh, these kind of games. And I do enjoy them, and I think that's the secret. It doesn't matter how good you are at a game, it's whether you enjoy it or not, it's important. And we're making it. Why, why would I say that? I mean, we're not at the top. Why would I jinx myself? I don't know if you can take full damage, but this could be a short run. Oh wow, I got something. Prison Bolt. Wow. Uh, let's have a look at this. Yeah. It homes, which is nice. It uses a little less RAM. And this is the time where I start moving around. You can see I've got, got sprint ability and jump thing. That can be upgraded as well. It gets really funky jumping. This is, you can jump from buildings and it gives you quite a lot of a uh, better sort of view. It's, so useful having a good jump. I really like using some buildings. So you can see my trailer destruct I say destruction. Two buildings are taken out. Those solid buildings are shops. We should probably check them out at some point. There's the white building. Try and keep your distance because it's sharp. That's my recommendation, especially when you're new. Once you've got wet sniper weapon. You could, you don't take all damage from that height. That's a uh, good to know. Right, let's go to the shop. See what we can get. Using my uh, little, uh, I don't know why I was pointing at the screen there, but as you can see in the right hand corner, my sprint thing's been activated. And you notice my ram bar's going down, which is kind of a good, yeah, again, lots of visual information, nice and uh, sort of funky. Yeah, so let's understand what's happening in the shop. I'm also going to set a timer so I don't do my videos too long, because let's face it, that's probably one of the things you've noticed about my uh, channel. It's my videos are long, and I did long streaming sessions when I was Twitch. And some people like that, other people like Plucky. What are you doing? Wow. So, you see red level options are like, I think they're all Chinese. Um, they're set icebreaker. And they have some good stats. Gold is quite good, they're rare. I don't know if set items like games like Diablo, the more you have the better that they do. And these are looking... Ooh! How many bit cards do you have? Because loot finds 16%, it's quite good, and I think if it's in your active hot bar, then it, um, those stats kind of add to it, so it doesn't matter if you're using them at the moment. And that's really good. And uh, I've got five bit cards. 
Sell yourself. How much are you worth? You're worth 150. I'll trade you in for effectively. Health. Leap find and hack speed. Oh, it's quite expensive. That's why I say good, Poppy. You know what? This is probably not how you should play the game. But, uh. It is. So that you can be my. Number one slot. This way. Let's see how much this costs. 80. Can we afford it? Where's it? There it is. Yeah. Sweet. I'm not broke. I've only got two weapons. But I've got a load of icebreakers. Which is good. Um. If you've got enough RAM, you can also have multiple buildings. I would not recommend. Ooh, let's go to this shop. Ooh, I should have probably gone to this shop first. Because, uh, healing. And having, like, active heal, where it, um, continually heals you rather than, um, so strong. And that would be my recommendation getting that early. early on. Ooh, black hat. Can you see how easily uh, seduced I am by shiny things? Does that do? It's good. So shopping early on it may seem boring for you guys and apologise. You can also get these things that help you zoom in, which I'm not too sure whether it's needed. Um, so we want plus health per tick, and that's what you really want. This one looks probably like the best one so far, so I'm going to grab that. You know what? I'm going to get rid of it. I probably need a jump. It's a really better jump. So, ah! Uh, Jetpack 1.2! Jetpack. Oh, Jetpack. Nice. You know what? Let's see that for the time being. Space. Jump in there. Excellent! Oh, think skate. Oh, check that! Uses my rat, but no, is it just me? I'm loving that. Ooh. Right, you gotta watch your ram because you run out of ram. Are we ready to take on a right? Oh, star power. That's my uh, weapon I got from the top of the tower. Those glowing buildings, like monster spawners, they spawn a lot of monsters. It's bad. Right, loving the music. Let's try out this. New and that's what happens when you uh, go out the arena, folks. I meant to do that, honest. Spatial Royalist is key in this game. Need star power. Now let's engage my healing thing. Healing? Oh, oh. oh dear, that's not good. Panicking. Oh no, get away from me monsters, get away! Fortunately, I'm healing, I think, faster than making any damage. That 21% damage reduction is doing its business. Oh, okay, I'm, I'm shaking. They grab me and they're like, oh, it's not good. Give me a headache. Try. Oh, that's good. Where are you? Where are you, monsters? Vermin. Oh, good. So yeah, if 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 you like playing like a complete noob like me, this game's uh, quite a challenge and quite intense. If you're like a stable plasma bowl, easily distracted, also this is a game for you. Um. Yeah, Rakai level 5. We've got two levels to level up. Uh, probably bit off a bit more than I could chew, but that's why having that healing ability is so strong. We need to increase our RAM at some point. Um, RAM use 10. Can't use it yet. So let's put that in the bottom corner. Let's escape out of there. Level 4, folks. I'm quite impressed we made it this far, really. Now, uh, yeah. So we're going to be finding lots of nice loot. Let's go and find an appropriate... Ooh, health. Let's find some buildings. If you notice on the top, it tells you what difficult they are. I just did crack to level 8. So how that went. We need to find some... A bit more... Yeah. And we need more RAM than that. A lot of my RAM has been taken up by that heal thing. We might need to find a more efficient version of that heal. Wow. Seventeen. Kev, I just want to press the M button, map. It isn't the button for map. I don't think there is a map in this game. I think it's ooh, like, you have to mentally map it out. It's cool. And now you're near the inner, there's quite a few easy blocks to do. It's the same shop before. Do we sell this off? 
it's worth 6,000. I kind of suggest it's probably really good. Uh, I think I'm going to hold it. And we can try it out. Uh, there's no rush, really. Oh, yeah. We can take it level 8. If we can get on top of the building, that would be amazing. Are you ready for this? Wow, well, that's... No. Disengage this. Yeah. Oh, we're on the building. This could even work. The, the spiders can find the building, so this isn't guaranteed to work, but... And uh, let's... Uh, we've engaged our healing thing. Pack remaining. That's good. Where are you, monsters? Where are you? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. No, no. No. Oh, it's massive. It's massive. Oh, it's pink colour. I don't like this. I don't like this. Okay. Did we get them all? Oh. One enemy to remain. I hope it's not one of those big spiders. It's going to be one of those big spiders. Okay. Heck. Notice how I'm changing the colours. Now, a little tricksy... Oh, wow, it's taking ages. Get a gold one out of it, though. And we've leveled up! Awesome. The thing about this is I like the variety of the weapons. They all have different roles. You can either have a... I mean, why even, why even ask what I'm going to put it into? Uh, so, that some of them can act like machine guns, snipers... I think this might be an absolute upgrade on this. I think, in fact... No, it uses, it uses a lot more RAM. So, uh, sorry, but let's face it. Though you'd expect me to do a lot of running away. It's not really my own description. Cool. Oh, we can put this. He's a lot of stuff. Is it better than that? What kind of weapon is it? Sniper. Does home, which is nice. DPS is. Yeah. Let's do that. Um, I think that's quite nice. Let's try out a new uh, fireball bullet. That's cool. I like that. Um, let's try this. Hopefully, we won't need it. Uh, let's find another building. Let's keep this going. Let's keep the momentum rolling. Twelve. There's quite a hike in difficulty to disengage the health. Gun it up to the top. And, uh... Engage health. Important step. That's me. Oh, it's I just I dread to think more spiders coming up here. Uh, packing time's coming down nicely. Oh no. See that like uh oh ooh. Yeah, that's an ability that burns me. It does something nasty. I think it freezes me. But yeah, monsters with stuff on top of their heads. Nasty, they're like special monsters. Ooh. We're leveling nicely, we're jumping levels. I think I'm literally out taking off a bit more than I can choose, but we're, we're handling it. Bit, bit dodgy at times. Uh, up. Um, yeah, just sell those off. Let's clear our inventory. What's this? Just, yeah. Uh, we don't need any more icebreakers. I think. I do love the jump pad. It's great fun. Great fun indeed. Do -do -do. Kind of... Damage return plus five. Um, yeah. You know what? I kind of like that. And you guys suck us through requirement. Movement speed. Good. Ram reserve 22. How much for ram damage? Weapon damage or movement speed weapon range? It's three ticks. Difficult. Ooh. Damage, nice. I like it. What was that? I think, yeah. I think this is pretty good. Let's move the jumps just in case there is a. Uh, there we go. Uh, boom. Need to find a weapon store. That's what we need to find. 
So I should have quite a lot of damage reduction on the old... Wait a minute. Why is it only saying 27? Okay, so maybe that's the cap for damage reduction. I have to keep an eye on that. Oh, okay, we just kind of found it, or was that what we just hacked? We have no center direction floats. This is a uh, classic lucky here, classic lucky. 17, do we, do we, do we feel, do we feel lucky for 17? I, you know, why not? So just keep to the corner if it gets too far. How far a rat is still? Look the road, it's getting there, it's getting all the way to the house. Did you see that monster leap? Okay, I don't know what weapon I'm using. Oh, get yeah. hello. Oh, we did it. Leveled up. So, if you want to keep leveling, folks, apparently the key is to pick higher, real high building levels than you. Maybe 10 or what your level is. It's <sighs> uh, up that. Ah, uh, let's do another... That, that one don't, don't know if these colours actually tell me more about the building. Something to keep an eye on. Out of range. Right. Ooh. Let's see those cubes coming. Oh wow, I'm not so good, guys. That's not... No, that's not good yet. What, what are you doing, guys? Like, is that on my face? Get off my face! Oh, my layers! Jeez! Oh, oh. Look at that little mine layer. So that, oh. I thought it killed everything then. Say, so pick off these mines so I don't accidentally walk on them. Yeah. Oh jeez, that... I just feel like I'm blundering through this game at the moment. Let's have a quick look at what this is. Cyber laser. Oh, it's kind of... Ooh, cyber missile. Hold the phone. What does this baby do? Hmm. Does cause explosions. Got anything rubbish that we can kick out? No. Kind of want to... Uh, sorry, new cannon. You're probably useful and everything, but... Let's, uh... Oh! No, just me. Oh, this is brilliant. Let's not. Number 17. Be rude not to. And this will be the last one. So we're coming up to the 15 minute mark. I think this has given you a. Why, why have I put it in a. Oh. oh, look at that. Come and get me. I've got a shotgun, guys. I'm not scared of you. Boom. That's a boom. Shoot me. Boom. I should probably not beat when you say boom. It's so much fun. It's like appeals to my like. Is this like. Oh wow, look at that stack. It's like it's ordering pizzas. Mm, tasty wine pizzas. Oh wow, that, that was. Yeah. That's going. You deserve to go in my top spot, my friend. Yeah, we'll leave the unstable plasma weapon sniper to that one. Cyber laser. What did we get? Scorcher. Uncommon machine gun. Hmm. Critical hit. Homing. Let's just let's just like compare. I'm not like. I mean, obviously. Oh, that's amazing. Oh, yeah. If you're easily like one over my boot or like bright colours, then this is the game for you. I'm a jumping puzzle. Let's, uh, let's go over there. So I think that's a good point to leave it. Will I, what will I find at the end of that jump puzzle? I could cheat, but I'd like to go cheat my way up to the jump puzzle. Uh, so yeah, find out next, next episode. What is on the top of that mountain? Or jump puzzle, building, whatever it's called. And what will Plucky spend his points on? I wonder. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed. Uh, I hope you will uh, check out Black Ice and uh, give it a go. It's multiplayer as well, which is always positive. Um, yeah, and I will see you shortly.
Have fun, have a good evening, good morning, or good afternoon, wherever you are. I've been the Plucky Hero, and I've failed, panicked my way through Black Ice.